Hello everyone, this is Yellow Toy back with another review. We are doing a unboxing and review of the course toys. I got these from the Designer Con 2018, as you can tell uh, in my channel. I'll put a link above this video so you can check that out. It's a pretty big Designer Con 2018. Well, it was pretty big and I'm sure it will get bigger. And so these are the two toys that I bought. This is the course toys. This is the Ruffle and Burnt Toast course. And then the other side says Pun Pun and Steam Shoot. So this is gonna be nice. As you can tell, four inch vinyl figure. And then it says right here, Pun Pun likes shoot raw pun pun like shoot steam and shoot can only wish this is something he has dreamed so just some poetry in there same thing with the other side too it has some poetry right there and check out the box so this is the top of the box the bottom of the box there's that authenticity if you're into that course and playhouse and there's the other side as you can tell same thing with that that's a nice artwork right there and so let's open this baby up so let's start with ruffle and burnt toast it's got to be careful when opening these these things and you know me i like to have them outside the box Ooh, pretty okay has some paper wrap to it. Not gonna lie, I'm excited. Very excited. These are actually the first uh, course toys, uh, course toys that I have. Put this on the side right here, and then let's open Pan Pan and Steam Shoot. Ruffle is actually a pigeon and toast, obviously a bread toast. And then Punchan is a uh, panda bear. I might have to prefer pun. I might have prefer pun pun, but then again, the price was good, and so I bought them both. And I bought this at Designer Con 2018. Okay, that's nice. Now I can already tell that this is absolutely in great quality just by touching it. You know, just putting them back in their original neat packaging. Put this on the side right here. And so here are the two. So who do I begin with? You know what? No, let's not begin with. Well first of all I can already tell from afar that these paint quality is absolutely astounding. Let's look at Ruffle first, okay? I mean, look at the paint quality, block colors, obviously. I mean, do you see any mistake? Obviously, it's more expensive than a Funko toy. There's the C, course, there's the burnt, very good detail and shading and spray. And look at the eyes. Unbelievable. Now, obviously, you get a great quality um, score right there look at that glimmering from pun pun and then look at that steam sh beautiful shading bamboo right there with the C course toys now obviously these two actually cost me um, I think $40 for both at the show so in terms of weight, they're not really heft. There's no heft to it. I guess if I really had to be honest, this ruffle is much more heavier than Pun Pun. I think they feel hollow to me. And I guess, how could I describe this? If you have a normal Funko toy, that's the weight of it. Normal Funko toy. I'll give you an example. If you have a normal Batman, Funko toy, Funko Pop, then that's the weight of it. 
but let's talk about the colors here and the quality I've, you know when it comes to coarse toys i'm not gonna lie i've always liked them for the colors their i mean emotions i can i guess you can say there's a certain emotion that they bring when you look at them i guess this is why you call them art toy but when it comes to colors and no paint uh chips no paint uh, transfer or even crossing over I already said it in the beginning when I was showing you up close beautiful paint job when it comes to the look of the toys it is an art toy I guess you can say just look at it I mean they they exude some certain type of emotions I guess I guess you can say same thing with art and painting the job of an art is obviously for you to stare at it. Whatever the emotions you feel, that's the point of it. It's not supposed to do anything. It's just there to be a piece for you to look at. And this is exactly it. And I guess this is why core toys are expensive, sought after. Also, there's a cult following when it comes to course toys. And just so you know if you're actually talking about sizing it is a four inch vinyl figure obviously made of vinyl per box and also per coarse toys and which one do i prefer i actually prefer pun pun i actually like the way it look pun pun but if you are into extravagant colors ruffle is where it's at ruffle is one of those toys that when you see it this is the first thing that you will see due to the colors the pink and the lavender and then you have the brown and then same with pun pun you have the green the j the black white the purple on the eyes and then the pink on the nose and so what do i think of these toys if you were at this show i believe and especially if you are into coarse toys or if you are into vinyl figure toys you got to get these because these toys are actually quite affordable when i said i bought these two for 40 dollars for both of them at the show it was absolutely great you had to get them at the show and that's where i got them i'm sure you can buy them online but if you're at the show you might as well get them and obviously just looking at the quality absolutely great obviously i'm gonna put them on my glass display and these are great looking toys and so that is basically it for my unboxing and review i will see you in another unboxing hands-on review and so and so here at yellow toy bye bye